Hello everyone! <laughs> Keeping things quirky and casual for this Aquarius video. Here are five things that you can follow in order to make any Aquarius fall in love with you. Slowly but surely. Okay, let's get into this. Number one, you need to show that you have brains. Not bounce on a ball like what I did just now. No, joking aside, um, if you are interested in an Aquarius, you need to uh, be able to keep up with their uh, very fast and broad mind. So you need to show that you can think for yourself, you need to show that you can think out of the box, you need to have a bit of general knowledge and uh, wisdom uh, that's accumulated in there, just because um, an Aquarius, and I'm telling you this from uh, personal examples that I've seen in my life, I've seen Aquarius men that wouldn't go for the hot a uh, sexy girl but would choose the intellectually challenging uh, girl that didn't look that great. So this is, this is one of the signs that where brains really matter even more than looks. So if you have it, then good luck. You probably are a good fit for, for an Aquarius and for exchange of ideas and for uh, broadening both of your horizons. But if you don't have it, um, then work on it <laughs> or just try to uh, try to really keep up with them. Okay, number two, be quirky. Um, Aquarius is the most uh, out of the box sign as I just said, so there's no uh, limitation, traditions, um, I'm, I'm afraid to speak my mind type of uh, behavior from them and it shouldn't be from you either. Just be your authentic self. This is what I absolutely love about Aquarius because I think many of us never show, not even to ourselves, our true colors and our authentic selves. So an Aquarius is always true to themselves and it's ready to show what they really stand for. And to be honest, we all are extremely quirky. We are just better at faking it in society or not. So. Just let your true self out. Number three. Let me look at it. Yes. Most important together with brains. So brains and this following as importance. Be a friend. <laughs> if you're looking for the Pisces, Leo type of romance of being swept uh, on a white horse in a Hollywood movie, um, it's not quite that. Um, with an Aquarius, it's more of a, a two great minds meet and it's more of a my loyal friend is also my lover. So you need to show that you can be a loyal friend. You need to show that you, uh, you are, first of all, beyond any romantic interests, a great human being which they can spend a uh, great time with and exchange ideas and someone that's there for them when they need you. So whatever you think of as the basis of um, a friendship, that's actually the basis of, of the relationship that that needs to develop with an Aquarius as well. So be their friend most of all. Okay, number four, be adventurous. I mentioned this for Sagittarius as well. I don't know if it's exactly the same type of adventure, although I think Sagittarius and Aquarius are usually a good match. Um, but it's you. they wouldn't be the type that uh, uh, just moves in a suburban city uh, with white picket fences, has 20 children, uh, never has any friends visiting and uh, just... Um, spends their whole life unadventurously there. For Aquarius, it might be travel, it might be, um, I don't know, a um, dangerous pursuit that they are in, it might be an intellectual pursuit, but you need to be uh, also as open for a non-traditional way of life and a more adventurous uh, type of life.
takes me to number five and that is hang in there. As I said before, uh, Aquarius can be adventurous, but even more, they can be extremely unpredictable. They are ruled by the planet of unpredictability, uh, Uranus. And um, you will see a lot of outbursts of changing directions or revolutionizing everything or even pure energy that needs to go out and it goes into ex an explosion maybe in their uh, in a fight with you or or maybe just in their projects or in something um, something that changes the course of everything so you need to uh, and I've seen this many times happening in Aquarius relationship because I have a lot of Aquarius friends I like them very much um, but I've seen relationships not making it because people have a very uh, narrow-minded perspective of how a relationship should work and usually that's why you'll see a lot of relationships between Aquarius and another Aquarius because they get each other they they get this continuous revolutionizing and storm inside they they understand this passion and a bit of madness um, and not everyone does this so uh, for anyone else that might be scared off by uh, by the rebel behavior that an Aquarius has, um, my my advice is to hang in there, and um, Aquarius will be a loyal partner and a loyal friend, and um, uh, you'll have the best exchange of ideas and. Uh, and actually, one of the most interesting uh, type of experiences in a, a relationship with Aquarius, but you just need to be open um, to think out of the box and uh, and just be there for them and hang in there. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. Uh, please write me your comments down below. Please tell me what else you are thinking of that an Aquarius might enjoy and I left out. And please also like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much. See you.